在会场外呢，在我后方这边就是一些支持香港的民众，而在对面呢是一些亲共的学生。那么两边是分成两个阵营，他们都在那边光喊口号以及举起标语。而现场也有不少的纽约市警方以及是校园保安在介入控制场面。来自香港学生倡导团体以及纽约大学的部分学生手举“香港加油，历史将判学生无罪”等标语，同时高喊“光复香港，时代革命”等口号。结束一党政治，建设民主中国。In the United States, what's important is that we're promised freedom of speech, something that the CCP does not promise its people. And it's important for us to use that here, spreading awareness, letting other people know, and standing in solidarity with Hong Kong. When they shout "Peace Out" in Hong Kong, the students on the opposite side are quiet, even some people are shouting "Stop the violence and stop the violence." The students also shout the New York Times Union Chairman of the United States Congress, Yang Jingxia, says that the United States students who came to the United States should go to see the real news. Maybe they are coming to see the real news. 可能佢哋係喺中國大陸裏邊出嚟讀書，但係佢哋唔了解究竟大陸嘅狀況啦，同埋佢哋只係係睇到圖片，同埋佢哋有好多嘅所謂嘅 fake news 啦，佢哋冇睇到真正嘅香港嘅和平示威者受到嘅打壓啦，同埋我哋真正嘅訴求咯。有來自台灣的學生到場聲援香港，並堅決反對中共對台灣伸出一國兩制的黑手。Some people think that one way ahead is one country, two systems for Taiwan. And I think I am here to say that many of us think that is unacceptable. That will not happen. It will not come to pass because we've seen what China does to its promises in Hong Kong. They do not uphold them. 活动主办方介绍，在十二月八号国际人权日，纽约将会有更大型支持香港的集会。新唐人记者柯婷婷、韩瑞，纽约报道。